you're my buddy now because we're sitting on the buddy bench, right? Yeah. What is your name? Forrest. Hey, Forrest. So, tell me about the buddy bench. How does it all work? Well, um, the buddy bench, um, people sit on the buddy bench if they don't have anything to do. And normally, sometimes a person comes over to the buddy bench to invite them to play. Yeah. Have you ever done that before? Um, no, but I have been on the buddy bench. You've been on the buddy bench. What made you decide to sit down on the buddy bench? Because I've had nothing to do. So what happened when you sat on the buddy bench? Um, my friend Emma came over and asked if I could play with her. Yeah, so you're glad that we have this buddy bench here. Mm -hmm. Hi, what's your name? McKenna. Have you ever talked to anybody who's been on the buddy bench? Yes. Yeah, how'd that go? It went well. They ended up playing with us. Really? Did you make a new friend? Yes. That's great. And you're still friends with that person now? Uh-huh. So what do you think about me sitting here on this buddy bench? I think that you should have a buddy to play with. You think I should? Yeah. Yeah? Why do you think somebody would sit on the buddy bench? Because either someone left them out in the game or if they have no one to play with, like if they're new to the school and they don't know anybody yet. Yeah. Do you know what that feels like? Yeah. Yeah. And that's not a good feeling, is it? No. No? All right, so we're with Mrs. Hartley Madison, who is the principal here at the Wood School. Tell us about the Buddy Bench. So the Buddy Bench was a gift from our fifth graders, and the idea was to help children on the playground that need a playmate, someone to play with, feel nervous or shy about asking to join a group or join a game. So it's a way to signal to others, hey, I need a buddy, someone to play with, so I'm going to sit right here, and it's been very effective. Well, it is, because I've been here for like 20 seconds, and you came right over. <laughs> I'm so your buddy. How long has it been here for? We received this gift um, three years ago from our very first class of fifth graders. And has it been used often or like how, what do you think the frequency of use is? You know, it's funny. I see it used every day. I see kids hanging out and just chatting on it. And I also see kids coming over and sitting with the signal of I need a buddy. So I think it's sat in and used every day. And I think it could be used in other places too. Why just stop it at schools? I mean, I think Fun 107 could use a buddy bench. Absolutely. I mean, why not have a buddy bench? Uh, you know, you go out to the supermarket, you can just sit there and be like, I'm just, right. I need a buddy to, to do some supermarket shopping with. Well, you know, all joking aside, I actually think people sometimes do go to public places and just are seeking out a buddy or a friend or someone to chat with. And, you know, sometimes when I go to local places around town, I see the same people in the same places and I kind of wonder, do they need a buddy? You know, and could we have a buddy bench at the post office and around town, you know, sure. and someone's just looking for someone to be a buddy. So I'm hoping that our wood school students kind of learn that and just kind of keep their eye out for someone who needs a buddy in life.